Well, Paul and Jessica, tonight that suspect is still on the loose, and the scariest part about this whole situation was just how close he came to some of the kids. This is Washington Elementary School, and I spoke with a little girl who said she saw that armed man walking in these woods just feet from her school. I was just thinking, whoa, gosh, I better get out of here. Not a typical day at school for this fifth grader. And we saw him wearing like a, a dark gray hoodie. Morgan Reeves says she and her friends came face to face with a suicidal man with a gun. Norman police were looking for that suspect after someone saw him walking down an alley near Lincoln Elementary. An hour later, Morgan saw him in the woods behind her school, Washington Elementary. It was just scaring us really badly. <laughs> Did you see a gun? Yeah, he pulled out a gun out of his, out of his hoodie. She told a teacher and then police. The threat rippled across the Norman School District. Six schools put on lockdown as a precaution. It scared a lot of the kids. We were all at recess and then and then they said they said it wasn't really a drill and me and my friend Cody were freaking out. We would have to sit on the ground and get next to the cabinets and like duck our heads down. Norman police believe Morgan's story is true and posted officers at the school, even escorting school employees outside to take the trash out. Morgan's mom is just thankful her daughter escaped the encounter without getting hurt. I, I couldn't think. I didn't know what to think about. And again, police are still looking for that armed man. They are not saying why they believe he is suicidal, and right now they're not releasing a description either. Reporting live in Norman, Bree Steffen, KOCO 5 News.